BBS is taking it to a new level. I am about to show you the future of BBS. Ladies and gentlemen. We are at SEMA. Unfortunately, Mark couldn't make it with me because it's a special day for himself too. Um, he's going through some crazy changes. You know, he goes for... <sighs> Son of a bitch. Mark couldn't make it with me, but I figured I'd take you guys along to this trip and showcase some of the builds out here and see some of the homies builds that they brought out. And yeah, man, Mark's a pussy. All right, so first stop, we are outside at the Pit and Paddock, which our boy Sam Dew runs. Uh, but yeah, this is the McLaren P1 we worked on. Um, it's wrapped with the new uh, wrapped by Inozatech. Obviously, we did the BBS LMs for them. We did it with the brush dark tint centers and brush dark tint lips. But this thing came out sick outside here at Turn 14's Pit and Paddock. Impressive Wrap did the wrap. Bowden did the titanium exhaust. But yeah, the wheels came out sick. At the CSF booth, where Mark Supra should have should have been displayed at, but clearly Mark doesn't know how to make uh, you know timelines and shit. But check this out. Got this G82. Look at this thing. Yeah. <laughs> Very clean. Could have been you, Mark. Could have had your super just chilling here. We were a whore. So now we're at our good friend's Turn 14's booth. We got the homie Dyes R33 here at display. Tell you, Turn 14 is taking over, man. It's very clean. It's very clean. Oh, thanks, man. Look at this thing, guys. Super clean. Another Recaros. Barney's Dick G80 M3, you know what I'm saying? Check out how clean this MK4 is. I really like this thing. Good taste, tasteful mods. Workmeisters. All over you, Mark. You suck, dude. All right, so circa probably five, six years ago, uh, Mark's car, his 997 Turbo, was in the spider booth. And is it back again? Is this your fucking car, dude? I remember your car was right here. But I don't think this is your car. It's not his car, right? It's different. It's not Liberty Walk. Yeah, it's not Liberty Walk. Never mind. That was a while ago when Mark's car was in here. It, it definitely shut down the Porsche game, but. Guys, so, as you know, we're BBS dealers. We're with the man of the hour, the OG, my good friend, Robert. Hello. Robert's gonna explain BBS's new uh, full form wheels with their spacer adapters, so show us what's up. All right, so we all know adapters. Typically, adapter is a bad reputation, but BBS has taken it to a new level. We've designed wheels and adapters that fit together about as cohesively as you could possibly make. So we have a threaded insert here, right there, and that threaded insert pilots in to a recess in the back of the wheel. So once the wheel is mounted, it is officially really part of the wheel. It's locked together. And we'll have, we have new unique bolts made just for us to fasten the wheel to the adapter. So. You heard it from Robert. He's trying to put me out of business. Basically, no more custom fitments from Ron. They just got these locking adapter spacers. No, I'm just kidding. But this is amazing. I think um, now all you guys with big carbon ceramic brakes or can't find right the fitment, you just got to lock in one of these and we'll get the fit for you. All right, so Jesse, the main guy, the VP of BBS, he's going to show us something crazy here. 
Say hi, Jesse, to the vlog. Hello, everybody. I am about to show you the future of BBS. All right, let's now, see it. It's not coming out anytime soon because we still have a lot of testing. But allow me to unveil. You've seen the it BBS here, Arrow. Ladies and gentlemen, BBS. Whoa! Arrow. Holy crap! Think of this, guys. I was like, oh, I got to get a picture of this. Wow, Jesse, you guys really outdone yourselves. This is insane. What the heck? What do you guys think of this? Very nice. Yes. None of the components in here are machined. Everything comes out of a cast and mold. And then, of course, you know, we clean it off and then finish it. Look how thin the arrow plates are here. Yeah, I see that. That's very interesting. You know what, the new Mercedes wheels, the E-Class have this certain design too, the arrow plates. But yeah. but it's a cover. Yeah, it's a cover. It's yeah. insert, yeah, yeah. snap in. Yeah, this, this is, is really cool. This is all part of the wheel, so you're not a, ever gonna have to worry about anything falling off. This is really cool. What's up, Mark? Right here, dude. It's what you want, the three bangers. All right, now we are visiting our boys at Gintani. I'm just gonna go fuck with them real quick. Hey, <laughs> Chinaman! You know what I'm saying? All right, now we are heading to Toyo Tires Tread Pass. Got some of the homies' cars out here. And yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys around. Super fucking modded Tesla, Jesus. Let's go. This thing is hey, nuts, that's an F40, right? <laughs> Ooh, this is really clean. Hello? Oh no, this isn't an RWB. No apologies, it's the MD kit. It's clean though. It's got like a 992 uh, conversion little tail light, as well as like a. Oh, look at all this. The detail, the attention to detail in this thing is ridiculous. What's up guys, it's Paulo. Um, did a tribute build for my dad, 240Z. Um, had the car for about nine years, never ran. Passed away from COVID a year and a half ago, a little over a year and a half ago at the hospital that I work at. And all he wanted to happen before was for the Z to run. Like I said, I've known, I owned it for about nine years. It never ran in my possession. And once he passed, um, you know, I decided, you know what, we gotta get this going. From paint, September 30, um, from Five Stars Auto who painted the car. Olive color, old 912, color code 414. Um, Absolutely beautiful, Thank man. you, yeah. thanks. thanks. Um, we, had a, we had about a month to assemble it. And like I said, the goal was to drive it in SEMA from the trailer, from transport, drive it in the tread pass. You know, she fired right up in the garage and I didn't want to bring a push car. Um, mad props to my best friend, Genesee, a JBZ Classics, Q Shouse, Taka, and all my partners on this build. Work wheels, Motul, Speed Hut, Skillard, Rohel's upholstery. Man, my, my crew team garage life, especially Toyota tires, man. For, yeah, for, for sure. Dude, build. Paulo, you killed this, man. Thank especially you. for a tribute for your dad. Unbelievable. Thank you, man. Thank you. you see my dad's signature on that, on that shift? Oh one? my god, that is clean, bro. The detail. And on the pedals as well. Look at that. It has his dad's signature. It's a tribute card for his dad. This thing. The paint came out immaculate.
11,600 steps later, two shits, two waters. We made it to the West Hall. This is my boy Greg's car. It's a Ferrari F40. We hooked him up with the BBS 18 inch magnesium wheels and our BBS white gold. But this thing came out super clean. He originally had 17 inch magnesium wheels, uh, but something happened to them. Don't want to get into it. Maybe I'll tell about it later, but these 18s definitely fit a lot better, which I'm really happy with. And the wrap looks super sick. He's one of the co-founders of Anti-Social Club, so the color matches, man. Very nice. I mean, how often do you see a freaking pink F40? Nuts. Got Josh, Bowden Auto House's titanium exhaust. Really can't go wrong with this. Can't go wrong with the freaking F40, man. That's for sure. I think this is Alex Choi's Miata. I don't know, I'm just trying, trying to open my own. Pretty sick. For a pussy? Just kidding. Me and Will found out Elon Musk made some fucking tunnels under the whole, all the convention centers. Now we're in a Model Y and uh, we can rest our feet, but this is really cool. Check this out. Some Star Trek shit. <laughs> kind of funny, no? <laughs> yeah, yeah. No laughs, guys? Can you, come on. No, no, oh, this is nuts. <laughs> Holy shit. There you go. Throw it on autopilot, bro. I wish I could. Oh. I wish I could. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah, dude, floor it. <laughs> that'd, be, That's cool. that'd be more than my jokes were. <laughs> oh yeah, this is sick. Wow. What do you think of Tesla? Oh, this is fantastic. I, I, I drive them for a living. So I don't imagine you're like, it sucks. I was <laughs> yeah. hoping you would slip or something, it'd be funny, but no. Alrighty, so it's been a long day. Flew in in the morning, did the whole trip, and we are gonna conclude it now. That's us. Me and Will are back to LA and hopefully I'll see you guys on the next one. See you.